welcome and good evening. We welcome you to our Monday night broadcast of the NBA here on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. David Aldridge is on our sideline. We've got the Boston Celtics facing the Houston Rockets. And now the opening lineup for Boston. They've got Havlicek. Russell is out there with Bird. Then it's Pierce. And it's Kuzi in at the one. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. Not backing up or backing down. Pierce knows he's got to keep going after his shot when the defense is trying to be tight on him. Taking two shots. good Paul Pierce you know in so many ways Paul Pierce is just remarkable I mean his skill level is so high I mean he can outsmart defenders and really has the mechanics to score the ball from anywhere Pierce hits two already a very confident player knocking down those free throws only fuels that and it's Harden with the ball for the Houston Rockets. Elijah one outside. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Boy, Hakeem's size makes him hard to match up against, especially when he's determined to score inside. This is his first free throw of the game. Two shots. Shooting two. The first one falls. What well, Akeem provides for his team is a rock solid foundation. They can rely on him on both ends and build schemes around his talents. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Have check with it. Good D by Elijah Wan. That is some tough defense there against one of the better finishers in our game. Harden dishes to McGrady. Russell against Elijah Wan. Pass to Harden. And the foul called on Larry Bird. That's his first foul. Personal foul. Second team foul. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. Drexler against Pierce. Here's McGrady down to five on the shot clock. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Here's Kuzi guarded by Hart. Pierce for three. A three-pointer is right on target. Pierce has got five. With his three-point shooting ability, Pierce can play either the three or stretch you out from the four spot. And that's part of what makes him so valuable. Now, here's Elijah on. Fires the three. And there's Tracy McGrady, the assist by Harden. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Here's Russell. Pierce feeling it out a bit. The pass to Kuzi. A three ball. Elijah on with the rebound. McGrady outside. And here's Harden for three. Here's Elijah on. Makes it off the glass. Hey, it's inexcusable not putting a body on the king. I mean, you deserve to get cooked when you don't do that. Outside, Russell. He dishes it to Havlicek. Pulls it from 20, and they pick up two. 
And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Now here's Harden. Malone outside. Here's Trexler. Bill Russell grabs the miss. Here's Kuzi, guarded by Harden. Havlicek. Whistle blows, bucket is good, and he'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. That's good. Yeah, that's the toughness of former Buckeye John Havlicek. He converts through contact, now with the chance for an and one. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Good from Applecheck. Yeah, and among the many things to like about Hondo, he is strictly about the team. Willing to take on any role, he just wants to win. Now here's Harden. Scoreless thus far. Got three off the mark. Austin leading by three. A teardrop shot. Elijah Wan with the block. Well, Elijah Wan is a ferocious defender and rim protector really excels at slapping shots away. And here in the first quarter, with a little over three and a half minutes played, and he comes up with the deuce. Here is Harden. Looking to end the run. Hands it from downtown. Every opportunity he gets, Harden will take that. He's very efficient from range. Here's Kuzi, guarded by Harden. Havlicek outside. Bangs home the trifecta. Havlicek's got eight points. Watch out now. When this guy gets into a rhythm, it is something to behold. Get through, get through, get through. Olajuwon deciding where to go with it to the inside. And Harden gets it to go in on the assist by Olajuwon. Five points in the game. Boy, well done on that pass by Olajuwon. He's just a tremendous all-around talent. Passes it to Bird. Shoots over Malone. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. It goes on Moses Malone. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the officials. For Boston, they have made three free throws so far. Haven't missed any. And he makes the first. You know, part of what makes Bird exceptional is his all-around talent. I mean, he gets it done on both ends of the floor, and that's how you end up being an MVP in the league. He's perfect from the line this time. Boy, he's got a great stroke from the line. That's not something we can say about all the league's big guys. Now McGrady. Elijah on the high post. Russell's there. He muscles it in through the contact, and they call the foul. And he's on his way to the free throw line. Great size and scoring ability. Hakeem, a tough assignment defensively. Drawing whistles, drawing fouls, nothing new for him. The Rockets shooting their third free throw shot of the game. Austin making a switch here. McHale's checked in. One shot. One shot.
And that one falls for Elijah Wan. The Celtics with the lead. Here's Kuzi, still without a basket. From downtown, and that one's good from Havlicek. Havlicek's got a pair of threes now in the first quarter for Boston. Yeah, we've talked about this often. Hondo does a lot of things that help you win. They're from deep range. And that'll help spread the floor, too. Boston leading by five. There's the three. Russell, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Really crashing that offensive glass, the instincts, the long arms, the quickness of jump. Russell kills you with second chance points. Traps in the tray. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Here's Kuzi, guarded by Harden. McHale outside. Havlicek against McGrady. Pass to Kuzi. Shot clock at six. Shot on the wing. He can't get that one to fall. Defense made an impact right there. Definitely got him uncomfortable going up with it. Fires from way outside. The shot, no good. Some solid defensive work there from Havlicek. Kuzi passes to Havlicek. Russell a screen on McGrady. Havlicek with it. Picked up by Elijah Wong. And remember, Havlicek was a highly recruited quarterback, so you see his passing ability on that one. Elijah Wong outside. Pass to Harden. Here's McGrady. Sinks the three-pointer. McGrady's got six. Punch, counter punch. Impressive offensive production early on. Hey, guys, this is going to be fun now. I mean, we've got ourselves a shootout on tap here. It's good. He has six. And what you love about Russell is he plays to his strengths. Nothing fancy. Just goes right to one of his pinkable moves. Now here's Harden. Eight points for him. Kicks it out to Drexler from the arc. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Harden's got his third assist on the night. Wasting no time on the catch. I love seeing Drexler go into attack mode right away. Havlicek against McGrady. Havlicek dishes to Pierce. And they wasted no time getting those three points back. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Now, here is Harden. Kicks to McGrady. Harden scanning the floor. Let's go. Rebounded by the Celtics. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And, guys, that's exactly the kind of high-impact defense they want to see out of him. Havlicek against Harden. Russell a screen on Harden. Fires from 18. And another basket for Boston. And, guys, you got to know who you're guarding. you got to run the shooter off that sweet spot. And for Havlicek, that's anything in the mid-range area. And Houston calls their first time out of the game. For the Rockets, Murphy's checked in, and Chris Paul's subbed in for James Harden. Substitution on the court. On the wing, Malone. Nothing on the board. Paul finds Elijah on. Here he goes. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. Hey, it takes more than contact to stop Olajuwon inside. He stays strong through contact and gets the finish. And what do you guys think so far about the offensive approach for the Celtics? Their chemistry. That's what really stood out so far in this one to me. Look at the number of assists they've been able to rack up so far. And they've also been effective from beyond the arc tonight. And if that continues, guys, it can really open up the rest of their offense. And that one falls for Elijah Wong. 
And so White will bring it up for Boston. Four-point game. Ball's not loose. It's off his leg. And the ref saying he kicked him. So it's Boston with it. Outside, Pierce. And he goes strong with the one-handed jam. Nice pass by Pierce. He has a complete game. And it's Houston's ball. They trail by six. Ball passes to Elijah Wan. Over McHale. Rebounded by the Celtics. Uh, you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. Well, you know, I hear you. That's a good look, but when you're that wide open, I think you got to knock it down. Here's Collins. Here's Havlicek. It's rebounded by Houston. Elijah has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Drexler kicks to Paul. Outside, Elijah Wan. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Malone. Austin making a switch here. Celtics leading by six. The pass to McHale. Here is Havlicek. Nice move. White finds Russell. No good on that one. Good work defensively by Yao. There's a minute 47 left in the first quarter of the game. And that one is good. His mid-range shot is very solid. I mean, for some reason, the defense let him have it. Passes to Sharman. Back to Havlicek. Screened by Russell. The lead pass was put in just the right spot. Russell's got eight. This one thing else that separates Russell from other bigs. I mean, the speed to outrun most guys on the court. And that one, good. Yeah, and there it is again. On a lot of their possessions this first half, they've established great inside position. Light the pass to Russell. Here's Sharman. Havlicek left side. And it doesn't even matter that he's surrounded on that possession. He's got the size to pull those boards down anyway. Harden can't hit. Austin leading by four. White looking around. He kicks to Havlicek. Fires from deep. McHale on the wing. Good, and it's Russell picking up the assist. Russell's got three assists now in this one. Mikhail always ready to catch and fire. Great confidence in his offensive game. Now, here is Harden. Ten points for him. Fifteen seconds left to play in the first quarter. Clock at four. From about 16, another miss by Harden. Very surprising that he came away empty there, especially given room to... He made it! He came out of big time! Wow. wow! What a way to finish up the quarter. That's an impossible shot, man, even when you don't have the clock to worry about. Mm. And so it's the Boston Celtics with a 10-point lead, some breathing room heading into the break, and their three-point shooting has paved the way for them. Back right after this. And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. And what do you guys think about Boston here in this one? Aggressive at running guys to the backboard. You could tell it was part of their game plan coming in. Yeah, and you know, when a team establishes an edge on the glass early, it really sets things up for the rest of the game. 
Celtics leading by 10. They've got Yao, Harden out there with Elijah Wong, and it's Murphy in a point. That's the group starting the second quarter for the Rockets. Up top, Tatum. From past the arc. And the rebound goes to the Rockets. Elijah Wong's got his fifth rebound in this one. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It goes on Jason Tatum. Well, you know, Harden will do that every chance he gets. He cleverly goes into the defender looking for the contact to draw the foul, and nobody does it better. Shooting two. And the first one drops. The scoring ability Harden brings is unique and next level. Good on both. Celtics leading by eight. Pass to Sharman. Russell a screen on Hart. Sharman the pass to Russell. Right wing. White against Murphy. And it's White missing. Boy, I'm absolutely shocked he didn't get that one to go. Usually he's money from deep. Castillo kicks it out to Harden. Launches it. Good for another field goal. Number five on the night. Five for ten shooting. And Yao just so big he's able to see over the top of the defense. And that allows him to find an open team. Right now let's send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Well, Kevin, Jason Tatum said his quiet demeanor may belie his hunger to win for some people. He said, I feel like sometimes I come off so laid back that I don't know if people understand how much I invest into this game, how much I care, how hard I work, because I'm not the loudest or may show everything. Kevin? Yeah, you know, his passion, D.A., for the game is right there. We appreciate your score. For about a minute and a half into the second quarter now. Now, here is Murphy. T right on him. They double team Yao. Six on the shot clock. Hayes the pass to Murphy. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Murphy's got his second basket of the night. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim. And get the finish. Tell you what, this is you know, this is what you want from your point guard. Kuzi just knows when his guys are wide open. Harden outside. Kicks it to Hayes. The pass to Murphy. Back to Hayes. Here's Yao. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. That was some slick passing from Harden on that one. I see him. Here's Kuzi. He's guarded by Murphy. Second quarter of play with almost three minutes gone. Russell is screen on Murphy. Here's Kuzi. Off target from three-point range. It's trailed by five. Harden outside. Here's Murphy. True on the 14-footer. Murphy's got six. All the talk is about Harden scoring, but I tell you what, he can dish that rock, too. Pass to Tatum. There's the triple, and a clear foul there as he shot the triple. He'll go to the line for three free throws. That's on Yao Ming. Yeah, good job trying to get a hand in the face, but you've got to be more careful. Especially on the three-point attempt. I mean, you have to defend that shot without fouling. Now you give a guy three free throws. You got this, you got this. And he hits the first of three. A young man who has an appetite.
for greatness. Always pushing himself as Jason Tatum. Malone's checked in for Hayes. Havlicek, he's checked in for Boston. Second free throw, good. And he makes all three. Gets trailed by six. And Murphy kicks to Yao. The dish to Hart. On the wing, Malone. Russell with it. Picked up by Malone. Here's Havlicek. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Havlicek's got 15 points. You gotta love his hustle, leaving the defense no time to react. And you know you're gonna get those buckets, guys, when you're quick to get out on the break. Get that ball up the court as fast as you can. And the basket by Murphy. Oh, good work by Yao, spotting the open man. That isn't usually a big part of what he does. Here's Tatum, and that's collected by Malone. And here's Houston, six-point game. And here's Hart. He's got 15. Yao with a screen on Havlicek. Harden the pass to Yao. Kicks it out to Harden. And it's Houston with another. Harden with that catch and release. Lightning quick. And here's Tatum. He'll bring it up for the Boston Celtics. They've led by as much as 10. Pass to Kuzi. He passes to Cowan. And the dunk to finish it off. A ah, beauty. In the pick and roll situation, now Kuzi is a real handful. Super skilled with his ball handling and also slicing that defense to pieces with his basket. Now here is Yao. Dishes to Hart. He kicks it to Murphy. Shot clock at five. Houston needs to get a shot. It's stolen. Apple check outside. Pass to Kuzi. Back to Havlicek from deep three-point land. The long distance three is buried. Havlicek's got five points now in the quarter. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Now, here is Murphy. Eight points for him. And then Malone with the dunk. He's so aggressive and confident inside. It's a real challenge trying to keep Malone out of the paint. Here's Kuzi. He's guarded by Murphy. Kicks it to Tatum. To the paint. Here's Kuzi. Gao with the block. Oh, this is the impact Ming makes defensively using that huge reach to block or alter shots. Havlicek against Harden. Now the pass to Yao. Here's McGrady. Three pointers off the mark. Celtics leading by nine. Outside Tatum. Russell a screen on McGrady. Kuzi passes to Russell. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. You know, individually, Russell affects the game in so many ways. But as a teammate, I just think he elevates everybody else's play, makes them better. For Boston, they have been a perfect 8 of 8 at the line. That 
free throw. No good. The Celtics making a switch here. Birds checked in. good on the second and so it's Houston with it trailing by 10 time out time call out, the out. Rockets without question John Havlicek displaying his skills well you know he's destroying them right now guys this defense has to make an adjustment to try and cool him off Kevin McHale who checked in for Boston Checking in for the Celtics. Number 32, Kevin McHale. And so it's Houston with it. Paul outside. On the wing, Malone. Gets an open look and hits. Malone's got his second basket. Boy, you can't expect Paul to miss that assist opportunity. His vision is excellent. Kuzi passes to Bird. And he gets the jumper to drop. Bird's got the lead up to 10 now for the Celtics. Uh, unwilling to let up even for a moment. That's his killer instinct just fanning the flame. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming. Attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. And the basket by Malone. Well, you like guys who can work that in-between area. Really keeps the defense honest. And I'll tell you what, guys. I mean, with his combination of size and touch, he's a real threat from mid-range. Collins. It's rebounded by Houston. McGrady outside. Paul looking around. This is a to Elijah one. Six to shoot. Doesn't go that time. Some solid defense there for McHale. Here's Kuzi. Havlicek right side. Money from the wing. Havlicek's got 20 points. Yeah, tremendous effort from Havlicek here tonight scoring the ball. McGrady against Havlicek. Pass to Malone. The putback. And it's Cowens with the rebound. And so Bird will bring it up for the Boston Celtics. Ten-point lead. This is their biggest. Here's Kuzi, defended by Paul. Kuzi passes to Cowan. Malone with the block. Dude, how about the quicks there by Malone to get up and deter that shot, utilizing that size and reach for the rejection. Austin leading by eight. Kuzi passes to Havlicek. Down low. The shot's good from Kuzi. Kuzi's got four points in the quarter. I tell you, Kuzi is, is pretty crafty down there on the block. Has that sense of how to score in traffic. Malone, left side. Pass to Tom Janovich. On the wing, Tracy McGrady. Rebounded by McHale. McHale's got his fifth rebound in this one. Havlicek outside. And again, Boston with the triple. Uh, he's found his rhythm from deep, and, and you can see the confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident, too. As a matter of fact, I mean, if you're stacking up threes the way he is, I mean, he's doing all this work from behind the arc. Now, here is McGrady. He's got six. Hey, even when well defended, McGrady has no issue with pulling up. Here's Kuzi, defended by Paul. McHale looking for an opening. Bird can't hit. Rockets trail by 11. That's a two from Paul. 
Here's Malone. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Here's Kuzi, defended by Paul. Kuzi passes to McHale. Inside, they get a hand on it, and that's out of bounds. Boston will retain possession. Drexler, he's checked in for Houston. Harden comes in for Paul. Russell, he's checked in for Boston. Pierce comes in for McHale. One oh nine left to play here in the half, and that one's good from Havlicek. And his passing is probably the most underrated part of his game. Pierce is a terrific playmaker on that wing. Now here is McGrady. He's got eight. Now here is Harden. Three pointer. Good on the triple. Harden's got a pair of triples in the second now for Houston. This team knows to just keep Harden fed right now because when he's on, he's cooking. Feeds it to Havlicek. Here's down low. Drexler defending. There's Pierce. That's good on the assist from Havlicek. Havlicek's got six assists now in the game. Poked away and stolen by Russell. And now Russell pushing it up. No one back to stop him. And it's Havlicek missing. Rockets trail by 12. Here's Drexler. That one falls. His second basket of the game. He's now two for three. Boy, that was a nice silky little shot there. Drexler getting inside and knowing just what to do. Here's Kuzi. Here's Havlicek. Oh, and he almost had a four-point play right there. He'll go to the line with a chance for three. And that could have gone from bad to worse if that three had dropped. And it came pretty close to falling. Well, he sure did. I mean, that would have been a heck of a shot. Let's see if he can get all three at the line now. And he knocks down the first one. And they haven't let points get away from them at the line tonight. That's always something that will allow a coaching staff to breathe a little easier. That one misses. Nails the third. And so it's Boston. Up by a dozen here at the end of the quarter. They've had such great ball movement and shot selection. And it's led to a terrific field goal percentage. And we'll be back with you shortly. Well, we've got a second half of basketball for you. We think it's going to be pretty good. A big comeback, though, is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. 
It's been one outstanding game from John Havlicek. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate within the first few quarters. And you know what? It helped that they had a few guys with very hot hands on the perimeter, too. On the floor for Boston. They've got Bird. He's out there with Russell. Pierce out there with Havlicek. And it's Kuzi in the point guard. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Hey, Harden is seeking contact. He is hunting bodies when he drives. He's so good at just getting his body into the path of the defense. The Rockets have been perfect so far from the free throw line. Six for six. That one is off. Good on the second free throw. Boston leading by 14. There's the pass to Bird. This one for three. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Bird's got 12 in the game. You know, it's interesting the way Bird shoots the basketball. Angles his body instead of squaring up most times, but the results are remarkable and unquestionably good. Now, here is Harden for the three. And that's collected by Bird. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. Pierce for three. It's rebounded by Houston. Elijah has got rebound number seven for him tonight. And the foul called on Larry Bird. That's his third foul of the game. And now let's take a look again at that incredible rejection. An emphatic rejection that was. Boy, you've got to appreciate that kind of forceful in-your-face defense. On defense, Boston. In the second half, they've only given up one basket coming from the free throw line. And it's out of bounds. The Celtics will take it the other way. Celtics leading by 17. Passes it to Havlicek. Russell a screen on McGrady. McGrady against Havlicek. Pass to Kuzi. Clock at six. Boston needs to get off a shot. Russell finds Bird. And there's Havlicek. That's good on the assist by Bird. Havlicek's got 30. It's been this way since halftime. Tremendous production from beyond the arc. Boy, it's been a three-point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. Now, here is Elijah Wan. He's got 10. He dishes it to Harden. Buries the long-range jumper. Harden's got four points this quarter. They knew this was coming. Harden can't just let that last three go. Way too competitive for that. Havlicek outside. Here's Bird. And oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. Harden the pass to McGrady. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. And stolen by Russell. Here's Havlicek. Elijah Wan with the rebound. Elijah Wan's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Malone outside. Back to Harden. Let's it go. And it's Houston with another. I love the spirit he's shown tonight, particularly on the offensive end. Boy, I tell you what, the hole would be a lot deeper if he wasn't being as efficient as he's been so far. Pass to Russell. The dish to Pierce. Havlicek right side. He kicks to Russell. Just five on the clock. Sinks that one from the post. Russell's got 11 points. You know, I don't think it's ever too late to make a sweet time. I mean, even if you're halfway through your shot, you might find a better one with 14 minutes. Now, here's Elijah on. 
He's got 10. It's good from long range. Harden's got nine points now in just the second half. Not sure what the defense was thinking. I mean, you can't leave this guy open from deep. Havlicek against Elijah Wong. Here's Russell. He can't get it to go. Good D by Elijah Wong. Rockets trail by 14. Malone passes to Harden. Harden draws the double. Malone looking around. Harden kicks to McGrady. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Harden's got six assists here tonight. And, and how about getting a hand up on McGrady, especially when he's looking to shoot from the outside? Here's Kuzi. Outside Pierce. Pulls from the top of the key. Connects the jumper drops. He's got 12. And I've been impressed with the unselfishness, but also getting guys the ball where they can do something with it. He is delivering a lot of room service times tonight. One sweet one after another. A nice shot by Elijah Wan. Elijah Wan doing what he does, going to work in the paint area, playing to his strengths and getting it up and down. Kuzi passes to Havlicek. And here we go. Harden heading to the hoop. And with that one, the lead is trimmed to single digits. The adjustments they've made offensively, they're putting guys in a position now to succeed. It's certainly been an impressive run. They finally found the right formula to break down the defense. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Oldham. David. Thanks very much. Well, the great thing in the NBA is the unknown. On any given night, you don't know who'll come out on top. And even coaches like Steve Kerr know it. He said, it's really hard to win an NBA game, and the difference between losing and winning is like that. Kevin? Oh, a game of inches, right, David? Just as you're showing us, a game of inches. Thanks. And now, the first timeout called here for Boston. Here's Kuzi, guarded by Hart. On the wing, Burke. Let's the three fly. That's another one for him, his fifth in just seven shots. This is how automatic Bird is. All he needs is the ball, and instantly that shot is gone. And some nice passing there by Houston. Oijuan finds Harden. Now, here is McGrady, covered by Havlicek. Six to shoot. A shot by McGrady, no good. Celtics leading by 10. Havlicek outside. The shot's good from Kuzi. Kuzi's got six points. When you allow good scorers to get uncontested shots at the rim, no wonder you're losing. You know, he should be getting extra attention from the defense, not less. McGrady kicks to Malone. Harden draws the double, and the foul called on Larry Bird. That's his fourth foul of the contest. And now only one away from being in the penalty. Yep, the next one puts them on the line, so they've got to be careful the rest of the way. Houston making a switch here. Murphy's checked in. Boston also with the sub. White's checked in. Celtics on D. They led the game at one point by 20. Here's Elijah on. Another miss by Houston. Here's Boston now, leading by 12. And there's the pass to Bird. Over Elijah Wan. White against Murphy. Stolen by Havlicek. The feed now to White. Jumps up, and White with the stuff. 
And I think that play sort of sums up what we've seen tonight. Just simply being outplayed both sides of the ball. Smart basketball defensively turning into easy points. Now here's Malone. Six points for him. If he with the ball. Five to shoot. Harden draws the double to halt the run, and he gets the bucket. Harden's got 13 points in the second half. Great focus from the clever guard, James Harden. I mean, so good at staying with his shot, even under duress. Applejack outside. It's hauled in by Malone. And that was a little bit of a range check for him. You know, guys, I think he's got confidence to shoot it from anywhere, but he could have gotten a better one than that. Now, here is Murphy. He's got eight and stolen by Russell. And here comes White. Leading the fast break, here's Havlicek. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. Havlicek's got 32 points. And let's get your guys' take now on the hustle stats for the Celtics. All game long, they've had active hands and, and really out in the passing lanes. And that aggression on defense has resulted in a ton of steal. I love the fact they've done tremendous work on the offensive glass. A lot of second chance opportunities as they've kept that ball alive. And it's good, two points. White's got four this quarter. And the defense, no factor, which is why he simply laid it in. Outside, Elijah Wan. Here's Malone. That's good. It's Elijah Wan with the assist. Elijah Wan's got five assists in the game. White against Murphy. Havlicek kicks to Pierce. Latrey trains it from beyond the arc. Pierce has got 15. And Pierce knows how to get to his spots. And when he gets there, he knows how to convert. Murphy sends a screen for Harden. Outside, Drexler. Harden draws the double. Six on the shot clock. And here's the fast break. Here's Pierce. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Pierce not afraid to seek out that contact inside. And this is his second trip to the line in the game. Paul Pierce taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for And so he hits both. Rockets trailed by 19. Al Murphy, eight points for him. Here's Harden on the win. Harden draws the double. Houston moving the ball around. And it's Tom Janovich missing. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. Pass to Sharman. Here's the three. It's rebounded by Houston. Elijah has got 11 rebounds in the game. Pass to Tom Janovich. Takes the assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. Tom Janovich has got his first bucket of the night. White dishes to McHale. Back to White. And White with the stuff. And puts the D in a tough spot when you have a point guard who can throw it down. He really does, GA. He really does put pressure on you. And you know, guys, showing how dynamic a weapon he is for this offense, they feed off of that energy and ability to make plays. It gets them going. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. Obviously, Yao is just so huge defensively, it's almost impossible to guard him legally. For Houston, they have been good at the free throw line this one, seven of eight. 
First free throw is good. And, and, you know, he's such a huge figure from a cultural standpoint. Yao is also someone teammates love playing with because of that easygoing personality. Jason Tatum, he's checked in for the Celtics. He hits both from the strike. 1-11 left in the third quarter. Pass to Sharman. Russell, a screen on Harden. To the middle. Yao with the block. And so it looks like the Celtics will retain possession here. Houston making a switch. But Brady's checked in. Charmin. Boston again missing. Rockets trail by 17. There's 49 seconds left in the third. From deep Harden. And Boston with the rebound. They led the game at one point by 20. And the pass to Russell. Here's Kuzi. He's guarded by Murphy. Russell, a screen on Hart. Just five to shoot, and he makes that one. Sherman. Sherman's got his third bucket of the night. And even with the big lead, he remains focused on the task at hand. Yeah, and you know, that is some shaky and shoddy defensive work. They've got to tighten it up. Hey, yo, right here. And here's Murphy. Right here, right here. He's got eight. Hey, Yao in the high post, and stolen by Russell. He got it up. That shot off. And so it's the Boston Celtics taking a 19-point lead into the break. They've had active hands and have forced a lot of turnovers in this one. now a chance to show you our assist of the game and it's presented as always by State Farm yeah an easy choice tonight look at the precision on this pass put it on a platter for him served him up a tasty room service dime right there boy and there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four Tracy McGrady is out there with Chris Paul then it's Elijah Wan. Then there's Moses Malone. And it's Tom Janovich in at the three, the small forward. That's the five for Houston right now. Now here's Paul. Shot clock at six. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. The craftiness of Paul really on display everywhere, but especially inside and forcing defenders to commit fouls on him. Paul, two shots. And that one falls for Paul. You know, Chris Paul has probably forgotten more about basketball than most of us know. He's an encyclopedia of knowledge for the game. Both free throws good from Paul. 
Celtics leading by 17. Here's Sharman. Cowens passes to Havlicek, and Havlicek throws it down. An elite score, demonstrating once again how fast he can fill it up. Now here's Paul. Passes it to Malone. And some nice passing there by Houston. That one go. Just count it. And, and just a step ahead of the D in that possession there, making the pass. Nice assist. Kuzi passes to McHale. And it's Moses Malone with the foul. Moses. That's his third foul of the game. And the Rockets making a change here. Murphy's is checked in. For your Rockets, number 23, Calvin Murphy. We play just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. Here's Havlicek. It's rebounded by Houston. Malone's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Pass to Elijah Wan. Good, and Paul gets the assist. Elijah Wan's got four points in the quarter. That was close to being a foul there. Great concentration from Elijah Wan. For three. And it's Malone with the rebound. Malone's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Pass to Paul. Kicks to Murphy. Back to Paul. Now the pass to McGrady. Five on the clock. Now here is Elijah Wan. Here's Malone. And the rebound goes to McHale. Celtics leading by 15. Here's Sharman. Kuzi passes to Havlicek. Here's the screen. The shot from the low post is good. Havlicek's got 36. And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. Outside, Malone. Over Collins. And Malone with the basket on the assist by Paul. Paul's got his third assist on the night. Kuzi passes to McHale. And it's Moses Malone with the foul. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. Gao checked in for Houston. And a change for the Celtics. White's checked in. And we're about three minutes into the fourth quarter. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. That's on Yao Ming. Shooting for Boston. Jojo White. Come on for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. free throw missing and he sinks the second we're in the final quarter of play here. Three minutes in. Paul passes to Malone. Over McHale. Malone, good. Malone's got four points in the quarter. You know, that's not how you screen for your guys, but ultimately, they still found a way to come away with the hoop. Now a timeout called by Boston.
Houston making a switch here. Drexler's checked in. Austin also with the sub. Pierce is checked in for White. Getting the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Hi, Kevin. Well, the head coach for the Celtics talked to his team during the break. He told his players, I love the energy right now. You look like you're having fun out there. Keep playing for each other because our chemistry looks great right now. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. Here's the pass to Kuzi. Here's Collins. Celtics passing it around. Count it. Good. And the Celtics lead by 16. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. To the paint. Here's Drexler. That's good. Great play set up by t -Mac, Tracy McGrady. Yeah, and you got to respect the size McGrady has. Easily seen over the defense there to spot the open man. Havlicek. And that one drops for him. Havlicek's got six here in this quarter. And so it's Paul bringing it up for Houston. Passes it to Yao. Dishes it to McGrady. Stolen by Havlicek. Out to the right wing. Here's Kuzi. Outside Pierce. Here's Collins, defended by Yao. Just five on the clock. Mikhail kicks to Pierce. Puts up a three. Good for another bucket. He's made half a dozen now. Six for eight on the night. An excellent jump shot. Pierce doesn't need a lot of room to get that off. Now here's Paul. He's covered closely. Yao with it. On the wing, Drexler. Over Pierce. And there's Clyde Drexler on the assist by Yao. Celtics leading by 17. Right side, Pierce. Pass to Kuzi. Havlicek left side. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Tracy McGrady. That is his first foul of the game. So for the Rockets, Elijah Wan's checked in for Malone. And it's James Harden in for Paul. Bird. That ball is good for another field goal. His sixth. He is six for nine on the stat sheet. Bird is really good inside because he uses both hands and that six nine frame to get the shot to fall despite solid defensive pressure. Now here is McGrady taken away. And here comes the break. Here's Kuzi. Finished off the break. That gives him the double double. 10 points and 13 assists. Good job getting the ball and completing that play. Time Boy, out, there's not out. much defense available once a steal is made. Started. That's the best time to attack on the break. Timeout called the Rockets.
Houston making a switch here. Murphy's checked in. White, he's checked in for Boston. Drexler finds Elijah Wan. Pierce against Harden. Puts it up from 12. Garnett grabs the board. Celtics leading by 21. Outside, Pierce. White the pass to Garnett. Over Yao. And Garnett with the basket on the assist by White. You know, the mid-range day of Garnett is a thing of beauty. Textbook release from the big man. Pass to Yao. To the inside. And the jam by Harden. Yeah, he's been hooping. But the rest of the team, not so much. White against Murphy. White dishes to Pierce. And again, Boston with the triple. We know he can hit that. Pierce, extremely confident from deep. White against Murphy. He kicks it to Elijah Wan. Down to five on the shot clock. Drexler outside. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Hakeem Elijah Wan. And that'll be his third foul so far. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Substitution on the court. And so Bird will bring it up for Boston. They lead by 24. Their biggest margin. Kuzi passes to Russell. He dishes it to Havlicek. Bird right side. Nice ball movement by Boston. Fires for three. It's stolen by Elijah Wan. And here comes McGrady leading the fast break. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. And it's on John Havlicek. Uh, meeting the defense with power, McGrady holds nothing back and finishes in motion. McGrady, two shots. He misses the free throw. One of the most ferocious scorers in the game. McGrady's length and athleticism is so difficult to contain. He hits the second from the line. Celtics leading by 23. Here's Kuzi. Bird a screen on Hart. Kuzi passes to Bird. With the teardrop, Malone with the block. Here's McGrady. That one falls. What muscle from McGrady right there, brushing off the defense with ease. McGrady's gone 5 of 11 from the field. Here's Kuzi, guarded by Harden. Havlicek outside. Deflects the pass. It's stolen by Elijah Wan. And there's the pass to Harden. Good. And it's McGrady who picks up the assist. McGrady's got three assists now in this one. And his stroke has been dead on from the outside. I mean, inside, outside. It just doesn't matter. Now, here is Russell. Havlicek outside. Six to shoot. It's tipped. Excellent job by McGrady using his length to deny that shot. Harden kicks to Drexler. 
Passes to Malone. John Havlicek on the wing. Took him no time at all on that one. Havlicek's got 40 points. Really nice job moving the ball around that time, picking apart that defense. Now a timeout called by Houston. And now we present our New Balance player of the game, John Havlicek. And his performance has been a jaw dropper. It must have been feeling great coming into the building tonight because once he hit the court, it was all working for him. He was in a zone. Well, to come in here facing a hostile crowd and have a game like he's had, that's what separates the good players from the great players. Here is Harden. Up top, Elijah Wan. And stolen by Russell. Here's Kuzi, guarded by Harden. Pierce against Drexel. Here's Bird. It's rebounded by Houston. Al Harden kicks it to McGrady. Pass to Drexel. Tries to keep it alive. And so Houston again turning it over. Here's Kuzi. Now the dish to Bird. Pierce for three. The rebound by Harden. There is some defense for you. For someone who's as good at shooting the three ball as he is, you, you need a defender who's equally good at guarding against him. Now, here is Harden. McGrady outside. Just five to shoot. Has to Harden. Let's it go from deep. Havlicek with the rebound. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Kuzi passes to Pierce. Boston again missing. Rockets trail by 21. McGrady dishes to Hart. 119 left in the fourth quarter. Elijah on finds Drexler. McGrady right side over Havlicek. The shot by McGrady no good. Celtics leading by 21. The pass to Bird. Over Drexler. A nice shot by Bird. 55 seconds left in the fourth. McGrady passes to Elijah Wan. Dishes it to Hart. Malone outside. Pass to Elijah Wan. Six on the shot clock. Tracy McGrady on the wing. No good. And they can't put an end to this drought. 
26 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Outside, Russell. He kicks it to Havlicek. Third left side. He feeds it to Russell. No good that time. Drexler with the defensive effort. McGrady outside. And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. A resounding victory for them. And Greg in enemy territory, no less. That's exactly right. But with the way they controlled the game and, and just completely took the crowd out of it, that's how to get it done on the road. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. And now we present the New Balance player of the game, John Havlicek.